What's up, guys? Hope you guys are doing okay, and I hope you're loving yourself, because remember, no one can love you like you love yourself. Um, this story is about loving yourself, and I want to tell you a story about someone that thought they loved themselves, but really they love money. They love money more than they self. Um, I, w- I was buying a commercial building from a guy, and so we met at his house, and um, when we went to go meet at his house, the title company hit, made me aware that they needed a copy of his will, because the building was in his will, which was in a trust. And so he gave me a copy of his his will, and I took it to the title company. Upon bringing the copy back to him, he asked me, he said, hey, Keith, did you look at my will? And I said, yes, sir, I did. He said, you see how much money I have? I said, yes, sir. He's like, well, and he held his hot head up in the air, and he said, you know what, Keith, I made all that money. I worked as a firefighter for 30 years, and then um, I owned a plumbing company, and I ran a plumbing company with employees for another 30 years, and that's how I got all that money. Well, not only did he have money, he had a lot of stocks and a lot of different things, such as casinos. He had, he even had gold cougar and coins. And this man was 80 years old. And But the way he was living, he wasn't loving himself. For instance, when I asked him to use his bathroom, he hadn't even flushed his toilet. That's how cheap he was. He was just keeping the urine in his toilet for days and days before he would touch it to keep, to keep the water bill down. So, you know... After he bragged to me with his head up high, and that's fine because he felt like he had a really big accomplishment, but this guy was 80 years old. And so I looked at him and I said, hey, I said, guess what? You forgot one thing. And he said, what's that, Keith? I said, man, you forgot to have fun. I said, you worked hard all your life, saved all your money, did all the sacrificing, and you never, ever have fun. Well, he thought about it. So the next day, my phone rang and he called me. He said, hey, Keith. I said, what's up, man? He said, "Um, can you take me to go buy me a new car and a house? So all that work that he had done, he never enjoyed life and evidently he didn't love himself. And money wasn't his employee, money was actually his boss. But um, make sure you think about what you're doing and how you're doing things and, and don't let greed get to the best of you because not only will greed hurt others around you, greed will actually hurt you. Um, have a good day. Um, like and share this video. I appreciate you guys. We're going to have plenty more videos coming. And uh, make sure you love yourself because nobody's going to love you like you love yourself. Thank you again. Have a good day.